Hey, what's going on boys? Sleeves Garden, checking in again. Got something a little different this time. Um, got a bit of an experiment. We're going to be running some uh, some photo photo seeds, 12 and 12 from seed. So um, yeah, a bit of an experiment boys. Never done this, so we're going to see what happens. Gonna start her off day 14. We're in a solo cups. This is one of the bigger contenders. There's a bit of a mixture of um, things. Some were bigger than others, but you know, to be expected. Um, but yeah, gonna get the repotting. We have nine plants in total, all 12 and 12 from seed. Um, so I'm going to get to repotting. We're doing some uh, potting mix and some compost mix. We're doing uh, three parts soil, one part compost. So see how it goes. We're also rocking under a new light, and this is the Solar D light. Um, I have not seen much. I haven't seen any reviews on this light, so. We're giving it a go. It's a uh, 240 watt light. Each one of those sticks are 60 watts. So yeah, we're going to be giving it a bit of a test. See, see what happens. Straight out of the box though, feeling nice. I was uh. I was feeling good out of it straight straight out of the box it was feeling nice on the hand so that's a that's a good sign <laughs> things were feeling sturdy so that's good got your uh, power box this is your power supply with the uh, dimmer of course dimmer felt so nice man I could sit there and play with that all day I won't but <laughs> I could have some stats there if you want to pause and have a wee look but um this power is also ah sorry the power supply also has some sort of uh, Wi-Fi connector in it so you can connect it up to an app and it, you have complete control over turning it off and on manually from the from the app or you can uh, set a schedule which what I'm gonna do I'm gonna set this light up build her up and I'm gonna set a schedule from 12 to 12, like like we said for the experiment. We're gonna um, so if all works out, we won't even have to turn a light on or off or anything, boys. It's gonna be hopefully smooth sailing. So I'm gonna get this built up real quick for you. But uh, this is a sort of from what I've found it's a it's a semi unknown brand you know it's not pushed on the market super hard so I thought you boys might be interested to see like a uh, something new you know not the same old same old you see these are uh, see these people sponsored by people and um, they're not even being truthful if they genuinely think it's a good product, man. <laughs> they, they're just getting paid. So, this is a genuine review. I am not getting paid by this company at all. This is a genuine review. Picked her up and gave her the shook test <laughs> and to make sure she was sturdy. And she, she was. It felt good, man. Felt nicely built. Genuinely feels nicely built. Feels good. So my hopes are my hopes are high. We're gonna um, we're gonna get this hung up. We're gonna get our repotted nine plants, and we're gonna put them in the. It's gonna be a tight fit, <laughs> but we're gonna put them in the closet. And here we are. We've got the light set. We have nine plants in total. And I thought for the experiment to make things uh. A little bit more interesting I thought I would take the three most 
healthy the biggest plants I would take the three most healthy and biggest plants and we would do a little test and I thought as you can see one has been defoliated <laughs> one doesn't have any leaves anymore I've been uh <laughs> I thought we'd do a bit of a test so obviously one's been defoliated you might have seen the writing up above saying topped this one's going to be topped so we'll get to it and um yeah, I don't know how this is going to go boys, this could be a complete failure, this. We're just going to see what happens. And uh, if anyone's interested to see what happens, stick along for the ride. Throw us up. I'm not going to bombard you with videos a hundred times, you know, like I'll, I'll throw you a video once every two weeks or so. Just something different boys. I know it's a bit rough, but... I've been enjoying making these videos, man. Really have, so. Thanks to anyone stopping in, checking it out. Thanks to anyone returning, checking it out. It means a lot, boys, so. Truly do appreciate it. But yeah, we're topped up. We're going to move on to the uh, the, the low-stress train plant, the LST plant, so. And I made a bit of a mess of it, really. <laughs> I was, uh, I was scoping it out, I was having a wee look, and I'm thinking, alright, I'm going to bend it towards me, camera ways, so I set up my wee guidance stick, and that's when I give her a wee spin, and I notice on the other side, there's a, uh, well I haven't actually noticed yet, I'd already start chopping like a bloody maniac, <laughs> but um, <clears throat> on the other side I noticed, um, there must have been a little bit of a lack of light from the last light. So only one of those shoots is actually sprouted out. And uh, I've noticed that and I've thought, well, because I would normally chop whatever the bottom, bottom branch. I would chop, chop that branch, the one towards the dirt, if that makes sense, like the way I'd bend it down. Um, and I sort of click on here and I'm like, hey, wait a minute. This one hasn't even grown, so I better to bend it the opposite way, so. Bit of a mess around. That's what happens, man. You sit there, you look at your plants, and you do the math. <laughs> even someone like me who has no clue what they're doing, I still like to, you know, think I know what's going on. Ignorance is bliss. But yeah, and saying that, boys, any any advice and any any words put in the comments is uh, massively appreciated. So if you could see something done better, or if you have any ideas or anything, boys, it'd be much appreciated. Even if you just want to throw a thumbs up, just to you know, helps me out, man. Lets me know someone's out there. <laughs> Not making it for just myself. Even if I was, man. I enjoy. Been enjoying. Just gonna hope I can get better at it. But yeah, I think I finally worked it out. Gonna get this thing bent down quickly for years. This is um the very first bend I do. I eventually will give it more but I just didn't want to push it the first time because if you've watched my previous videos you, you'll know I've snapped a plant before and uh, it's never fun <laughs> but yeah boys low, low stress trained topped and defoliated we've got three plants we can focus on the rest we can just sort of watch in the background. Or if anyone has any ideas, if you guys want me to do something crazy with one of them, let me know. I'll throw your name on the on the pot. It can all be down to you. <laughs> Someone wants to say, you know, super crop it, do something crazy. I'll, I'll take it, take note. All right, boys, we're on day 30. We started day 14, and I thought you'd just have a look at the topped plant, boys. 
absolutely beautiful nice structure no training apart from the topping just topped get a bit of a leaf tuck happening in there just to let those side branches get more light I've been running the light on uh, just over quarter power so it's once the uh, flowers start showing I will turn it up and we'll get to see the full potential of this light but so far I'm really impressed really really impressed to cover all nine plants with only 240 watts I'm really impressed with this light it's doing really good this is our defoliated plant it's not looking so defoliated anymore it's sort of it's bounced back a lot boys but um, I'm gonna stick to it I'm gonna stick to the defoliation so I'm gonna get rid of uh, get rid of these top leaves right now I did chuck a couple bug clips in there just to spread one of those uh, branches out but mostly just defoliated nothing else <laughs> But um, I'm gonna chop. I'm gonna chop all those leaves off, boys. Like, you will see. <laughs> uh, I will not only the top ones. I'm gonna strip this thing down naked. It's gonna be a true experiment. <clears throat> so if anyone wants to follow along, boys, definitely do so. And I'd be stoked if you did. But yeah, day 30, boys. It's moving along. Am really impressed with this light, truly. Um, and if anyone, it's it's a really good price. It is a uh, a lot cheaper than some of these other lights on the market for the same power, the same stats. You know, um, if anybody is interested, I'll put a code in the uh, description. I'll put some links in the description and the code in there and I do not get paid from you guys using this code so this is a genuine recommendation like this is a nice light boys like I would definitely recommend it if you're on a budget and you're trying to get a nice light built-in timer everything I definitely keep it in mind boys but yeah I'll catch you up I'll see you I think uh Day 50, boys. I'll pop an update, update day 50. So next one I'll see is day 30 to 50. Take care, lads. Happy growing.